Back in 2008, Mirror's Edge blew my mind. Something about the visuals, the gracefulness of the movement, and just the whole aesthetic of it stuck with me. There were a lot of things about the game that made it stand out from other games I was used to seeing. There was no HUD, you could run on walls, you could see your arms and legs in first person, you could fall to your death in first person. I feel like no matter what year it is, the game will always look new. Now, keep in mind, I was a kid during the time when I first saw the game. So I didn't really understand much about games, or what made them good or bad. In fact, I don't even think I was fully conscious yet. Just yesterday, I developed part of my prefrontal cortex and I recently started seeing colors. Even then, Mirror's Edge had a firm spot in the back of my mind for years. And as I grew up, no other game has left such a strong first impression on me as that first trailer did. I know there are differing opinions on the game, so I might be biased, but this was a game that I wanted to play based purely on how cool it looked. And there's one other thing I haven't mentioned, but is equally, if not more important, than all the other things I mentioned. The music. The music tied everything together. The ambient, cold, but futuristic cityscape was well supported by the spacey and elegant background music. I've changed schools, cities, and basically life paths in general, and that main theme has been in the back of my head throughout all of it. Speaking of, I have a funny story about the main theme. So the song Still Alive by Lisa Miskovsky is the main theme of the game, as we know. So when 9 or 10 year old me searched Still Alive into YouTube expecting to find it, you could probably guess how confused I was when all I found was Still Alive from the Portal series. And that's how I discovered Portal. Now, I didn't get to play the game for a long time. Rather, I just admired it from afar. Even then, the game still fascinated me. And though it remained in the back of my mind, I had this lingering desire to play it when I eventually got the chance to. Fast forward a couple years, to summer of 2019. I was sorting through some old music when I stumbled upon the main theme of the game. And from that point, I was hooked. And I was suddenly reminded of why I liked the game so much. And then it dawned on me. I should play it. I don't know why I didn't play it earlier, but it is what it is. So I bought the game and I played it. And it lived up to the hype, certainly. The catch, however, is that back then, I didn't record my first experience playing it. Which is something I'm going to regret forever, as I will never be able to play the game for the first time ever again. But, I can still record it now. And given how I have no recollection of my first playthrough, I figured now would be as good a time as any to record myself playing it. Which I did. I already went ahead and played and recorded the entire thing, and this is the one time I'm glad to have a terrible memory, because I was able to be astonished by the game once again. Although I got stuck on almost every puzzle because I have the problem-solving ability of a mango. Still, I would strongly recommend the game to anyone who hasn't played it before. Just remember to turn off physics hardware acceleration because for some reason the game kept crashing when I had it on. So, without further ado, I present to you a playthrough of Mirror's Edge. And I hope you, audience, enjoy it along with me. Alright. Welcome to Mirror's Edge. I've been pretty excited to do a let's play of this game for a while now, so let's just jump right into it. So what do we have here? Oh, oh yeah, so this is my last played game, but we're going to start a new game because, you know, a new let's play. Choose difficulty. I'm a pretty normal guy. Once the city used to pulse with energy, dirty and dangerous, but alive and wonderful. Now, it's something else. The changes came slowly at first. Most didn't realize, or didn't care, and accepted them. They chose a comfortable life. Some didn't. And those who refused to conform were pushed to the sidelines, criminalized. They became our clients. We call ourselves runners, 
We exist on the edge, between the gloss and the reality. The mirror's edge. We keep out of trouble, out of sight, and the cops don't bother us. Runners see the city in a different way. We see the flow. Rooftops become pathways and conduits, possibilities, and routes of escape. The flow is what keeps us running, keeps us alive. Time face. Yeah, I know you hate it, but that fall took you out of commission for a while. What now fall? You gotta keep sharp. Did Start I fall off? City. Check out these new training grounds. Pretty slick, huh? So let's not run around, duty. So get to her and just go with the flow. Okay? Oh no. The first thing I get to do is jump. You can teabag in this game. Learn the basics of movement and momentum. Can I restart the challenge? Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no, we're back here again. Okay. Oh, I can move now. For real this time. Use space. Yeah. Look how pretty this game is. This came out in 2008. Hello. Hi, Faith. Welcome back. Didn't think we'd be seeing you so soon. She just falls and dies. Yeah, I can wall run. Look at me. I'm an athlete. Oh, this is my favorite part of the game. Yes. Watch this. Oh. I'm a gamer. Four minutes in and I'm already nearly dead. I just can't get over how good this looks, even for... Like, this is before 2010, technically. <laughs> I was literally- uh, I was literally about to jump off of the freaking building. Huh. Hello. Can you teach me how to do video games? Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna keep going this way. You- you can- you can play the game without me. How far does this go? Oh. Okay. That answers my question. Bro, I have one glove. I'm like Michael Jackson. Yeah. And I made a Michael Jackson noise right as I said that. <laughs> oh, okay. Don't look at me like that. Carefully walk out on the ledge. Yeah, that's sick. I right, watch this. Oh. Okay. We get to watch her again. How do you do a flip? I want to do a flip. Watch this, I'm going to do a flip.
I didn't do a flip. It's okay. And jump! Hello. Ladders, dude. <laughs> Pigeons. Okay. Oh no, it's the combat training. Okay. Mark wants me to run you through some sparring. You know how he is. All right. Okay, come on. Am I allowed to punch a woman? I don't think I should be really be asking this. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Left shift. That's control. Left shift. Alright. Nope. Oh, wait, did I climb on top? What the heck? Oh, wrong one. Dude, I can't read. Alright, Faith. Let's run through some weapon disarms. Just in case. I could just stay here, actually. Y you can go on without me, I'm not gonna play the game. Actually, no, I'm just kidding, obviously. We're here to play the game. Oh! <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, you can't do that. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> do it. Do it. Do it! Okay. <laughs> I'm going to waste so much recording space doing this. Watch this. Whoa, whoa! I- I shot her hair! What if I- what if I like- Can I shoot your ponytail? Oh, okay, you can. Remember what I taught you, Faith. Isolate them. Fight them one at a time if you gotta fight. There's only one. I- I'm only seeing one person. Okay. Hey! I slapped her on the head. I don't know if that's socially acceptable, but who cares? And I did it again, but in slow motion. Hell yeah. Okay, that's enough training, ladies. Gotta get to the real thing. Drake's got a job for yourself, so check in with him. Faith. Let me know when you're ready to get going. I'm ready. See you later, Faith. Why does everyone act like I don't talk? I've completed the training. What do I want to do? Uh... Eh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my controller's plugged in. Everything's gone wrong. Uh, how do I unplug the controller? Ah! Uh, I want to play the game! No, I, th I think I'd rather stay here. Welcome to 2008, dude. 
Can I just jump onto the thing? No, you can't. Oh! That's awkward. They were all about clean energy back in this game. Look at that, solar panels. That's gotta hurt. Alright. Which way do I go? Oh. Eh. Nope. Uh... Stop struggling. We're good. I know what I'm doing. Watch this. Oh. You're taking your sweet old time, so let's get pissed. She's almost at the comm tower and you ain't. Get moving and give her the bag. Cell will take it from there. Hi. Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me. Am I... I don't even want to say it. I don't even want to say it. Oh no! What? What did I lunge at? Oh, I think I'm holding my mouse too tightly. I just accidentally right-clicked. Yeah, just take your time. Eh. Holy crap, this game's bright. I thought I wasn't gonna make that. Okay, these guys have Stormtrooper aim. I can aim better than that. With a steering wheel. Alright, watch this. Ooh! Stay down, son. You ready, son? Yep, I can see safe now. I'm just gaming. What are you doing? <laughs> Alright, this is pretty fun. It's exactly how I remembered playing playing it back in like 2019. Oops. I'm still pretty trash at the game. There are more blues on the way. Uh on, but babe. at least it's pretty. Bag alert. Okay, I got it from here. Okay, they're playing rough cell. I'll be fine. Get out of here. Oh yeah, just take your time trying to shoot me. <laughs> you gotta get off that roof, mate. Don't care how you do it, just do it. I wonder how I'm gonna do it. Oh my god, she's literally me. Wait. This is meant to be a low-key job. Why the hell were they shooting? What did you do, Faith? Nothing. They just opened fire. So what the hell's happening? I'll ask around. Get your ass back to base, Faith. Cool.